What is going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm home for the holidays, and uh, <clears throat> it's really good to get out of Charlotte and get get away from everything, get away from the Riley's for a while. And uh, I'm about to go upstairs, talk to the fam, and we can get some breakfast. Would you shut up? Why is so much to say, man? Whew. It's cold. Oh my goodness. Piss off the neighbors real quick. I thought I would film a, a really cool video that, you know, I, I don't really have the chance to very often. I want to sort of show you guys my uh, hometown, uh, Asheboro. You know, I, I don't get to come here very often. When I do, uh, I usually don't have enough time to film, but seeing that I'm going to be here for a while, I might be able to film a couple videos and uh, we're going to get breakfast and I will come back to you guys once we're in the town of Asheboro. So stay tuned. So <clears throat> I wanted to start the, uh, the, the tour with this street right here. Now this street is Pineview Street and uh, it's the first street where I got stopped by a cop. I was 17 years old. I was heading the opposite way though. And uh, he caught me going 50 down this street. It's a 35. It must be going 41. I'm safe. I told you I was going to drive the speed limit. But uh, my grandpa used to work back there. That used to be an old Goodyear plant uh, years ago. It got uh, shut down, rebought, shut down again, bought again. It's been several different things. I don't even know what it is now. Uh, it's completely different. But I used to live down this street too. Uh, that's when I started going to uh, middle school and uh, early high school in Randleman. Uh, which I should have shown you those schools first. It's just kind of weird filming a school, you know what I mean? I'm not trying to look like that. But uh, this, the last unit. On the right, that's the one I lived in, and my best friends uh, Beatrice and Steven lived in the in the neighboring house right next door. So we would be outside playing all the time, and uh, man, it was it was great. I used to ride my ripstick up and down the street, even though it was busy. I didn't I didn't care because the hills are so great, and you get so much speed. And uh, I actually fell down that hill one time, and. Uh, there used to be a building there. It used to be Garner Pawn Shop, but it's gone now. But anyway, I fell one time because it was raining, and uh, I skipped my elbow really bad. The next tour, tour spot, I used to live down that road, and we're going to turn right now. And this charger, though, it's awesome. It's pretty cool. Used to have some friends that lived in that neighborhood over there. And I missed this. Dude. 
open roads. You see how open this is? This stuff is so awesome. You don't get this in Charlotte. In Charlotte, yeah, you, you may be able to find a road like this, but there's going to be like 20, 30 other cars on there with you. Like, there's going to be five behind you, like five in front of you, and six coming down the other way. And you're always going to see another car. Right now, I don't see anybody. I don't see a single soul out here, man. It is, it is awesome. Now, this is Draper Street. Well, not, not yet, actually. This is actually Old Liberty Road. I did live on this street as well. But I'll show you where I used to live on Draper Street uh, back in... Uh, it was a late high school into my first years of college. I lived there. And it's actually, if you turn, you see this, I don't know if you can see that yet, but where those cars just left, you would turn left on that street. And my house was literally 1,000. You can't see it from here, but it's the blue one. And it's right on the corner of Draper Street. So, and that was a cool place to live in. I just didn't like all the hoppy things that live there. And they're, they're, the technical name for them is camel crickets, but we called them hoppy things. We, we didn't like them. We didn't like those at all. The next place of interest is over here. This this house right here. I lived there. That, I lived there. That's uh, the, we, we call that the Old Liberty Road house. And we lived there for a short time. Oh, third gen. Virgin Camaro over there, awesome. But uh, we lived there for a short amount of time. Uh, I believe, I can't remember how old I was. But I'm pretty sure it was around elementary school. What is that right there, a green car? What's that be right there? I don't, I, don't, I don't know old cars. I, I want to say it was a Camaro, but it, it, I, don't, I don't remember old Camaros having those double headlights like that one did. Ladies and gentlemen, we have food. A lot of food. It's going to be great. We're about to get on 220, the highway that connects to everything.